Today, I like to talk about a vacation reset. Um, you know, Master Cho Kok Su used to recommend going on a retreat at least once a year. Um, but I, I like to I like to go on like small trips at least four times a year, and it's just to get away from you know work. Um, and sometimes I'm working while I'm traveling, but just to get away from the daily routine and and breaking whatever like you know whatever you had going on before uh you mentally take a break from that and then when you come back to it you come back to it with like fresh eyes fresh mind uh because sometimes when you're working on stuff too much it's just like you're too into it too much in your head but when you take a break from stuff and cut the cord from it it has time to go out and manifest in the world and and you know bring you the results you're looking for and like now i'm on the way to um Bovina, which is like a place in the mountains in New York, where the air is fresh, uh, and that's another reason why to get out of the city is to get fresh air. And because you know we we live here next to the highway, and so it's actually pretty polluted. You can see the you know the pollution uh, from the highway. Uh, you know you can see it like it's like a haze over the the whole area that's you know near the highway. You can see it, like in the distance, you can see it. Um, but getting away regularly, even if it's just for the weekend, uh, or even just a couple days, like last month we went to Tennessee for um, four days, and it seemed like we were gone a lot longer than that. But it was just four days in the mountains, just hanging out, uh, you know, hanging out with family, um, you know, partying up. And uh, it was a great uh, mental vacation, physical vacation. I noticed my meditations were really, really deep when I was in the mountains. Like the first night I was there and I was meditating, I noticed my aura could expand more and the stillness was very, very deep. Because we were practically in the, in the forest of the mountains, you know, the mountain forest. Um, even though the hotel was like, it's like right there with the mountain behind it. And you could really, really just tell the difference between that and being in the city. So going out, you know, away from the city, at least two hours is what Master Choa used to recommend. Um, that your retreat needs to be at least two hours out of the city because typically that's how big the aura of a big city is. And I remember we were going to LA one time and I was driving Master Choa and we went from Vegas to LA as soon as we it was about in about two hours outside of uh, Los Angeles you know past Riverside there and you could feel when we hit the aura of the city it was like hitting a wall of emotions uh, so that's a you know good reason to get out of the city and go on a retreat all right have fun on your next one bye bye